Welcome back, everyone. The the bombshell is slowly dropping. Mm. Uh, we're we're about we're about to find out. Police. Murder. Hey. What happened here? The premise is closed. Are you affiliated? I work here. Henry. Oh. What's going on? Was that Louis? It didn't work. The investors were already here and we were waiting and... So Louis, he did the demo in your place, but they wanted a live test. He did the demo in my place? Dr. Heinz and Dr. Yu are still inside talking to the others, they said. Henry, wait. He tested the thing on himself. Because she was late. Damn. Love gets in the way again. Oh, what good is a memory interfacing machine if it kills the user? We don't know that for sure. It's just one failed attempt. Well, good luck with more attempts under all the regulations. This is going to trigger. We are under the radar. We can get around those. No, you were under the radar. Yeah, and now you're like totally over it. Either way. If there's a fundamental incompatibility with writing the memories, that surely doesn't bode well with the core of the project. Oh, and a bunch of, you you are a bunch of oh you you bunch are so pessimistic. Can I take a guess real quick? Cause something just clicked for me. <laughs> What's up? Wonder his last name doesn't happen to be Sigmund. That's my guess. Ah, right, let's go. Um, haven't you heard of pivoting? Let's not lose our heads over a little set. How is this a little setback? Yeah, what's even the point of memory interface if they die in the process? Well... Henry? I know what those you. Oh, yeah, my bad. Linry? <laughs> Wait, Linry. Now we're the ones oh, being tested on. <laughs> the prototype just died. The prototype kills people. Fantastic. Kills Louis. <laughs> but now I feel like we're being used. Because we're in it. He ran. They caught up. She left. He's home. Hey, you're back early. What's wrong? I want to go. You want to go live at the residence? No. I want to go see the world with you.
It's the real Eiffel Tower! It's the real stone head! Oh wait, it's everything he fucking showed her. This looks darker than all the other people. Very suspicious. Hmm. He's still there. Pizza? The pyramids? Lamel. They're happy. Oh, the Great Wall of China. Michelangelo. Mm. Lamel. Mm. I've only seen that statue through pictures. I gotta say, it's a big confidence booster. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, Quince. I'm glad we went on this trip. We'll come back again one day. Back home. And she's tired. Oh no, don't fall. Linry? Are you alright? Yeah, just a little bit air sick from the bumpy foot, I think. He's crying. Are you sure? I've never seen you get airsick before. I'll give your doctor a call. Let's just get, let's get you checked just to be sure. Somehow, always end up in a doctor's office in every one of these games. Huh? Pregnant? Yes, so it seems. Congratulations. Sorry, I would have picked up that line, but I'm a little in shock at the moment. <laughs> Pardon me. Is this not planned? I mean, no, but. But, but, doctor, my files. Yes, I know about your condition. And can I really still? Honestly, it's a legitimate concern. But, how do I put this? 
Most people have some form of hereditary risk factors to pass on. Linry. Is this Neil's mom? I don't know what's going on. No, if something with extreme risk can Huntington's disease, uh, deterrence might be called. But with no serious but common types such as cancer, then it's typically not. A rare condition on the other hand. Although also severe, it falls somewhere in between. And don't get me wrong, I'm not exactly encouraging it, but and there are other issues. But this is still a decision that only you two can make. <laughs> this is a very familiar scene. What are you thinking? Are we really considering this? I don't know, but we have to make a decision. You did say you wanted a family, right? Yeah, but this is about more than what I want. I mean, not too long ago, I was still preoccupied about my own livelihood. I suppose I've been doing really well lately, but still. Maybe we can book some tests? Medical advances have a long, come a long way. That only tell us the odds. It's it'd be a risk either way. And even if all of that aside, to become parents at all. What about you, Quince? I mean. Would you even want to start a family? Honestly? Before my grandmother passed away, she was the only family I had for so long. I can barely remember being together with my parents, but I still remember the feeling. To have our own family? Honestly, it sounds rather nice. But as you said, this is about more than just that. I'm afraid, Quince. Me too, but it's our decision to bear. For what it's worth, just know that whichever we choose, I'll see it through with you till the end. Well, I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on there. Thinking? Leaving? Doctor's coat? Right there. Yep, there's the heartbeat. Did you say heartbeat? I see it! And over here is the arm. We got an arm, Lindry! And the other arm. It's freaking out over arms. Popping off, wow. Oh, already born? 
Oh no, not already more. Comfy shoes for sure. And don't forget your prenatal vitamin. But most importantly, sleep. So you can have something to reminisce about. Well, we were thinking Tobias, if boy. And Ga Gabriella, if... Gabriel, if girl. Oh, those are both lovely names. Yeah, come on, it's... This is wonderful news. Yeah. Take extra good care, okay, Lynn? I will. By the way, you know you can already find out, right? Wait, find out what? The gender? The gender? Shopping? Oh, dude, she's craving. Well, it looks like... What is it? Yup, it's a boy. This is, con this is confirming my theory. Uh, more craving. Oh, and this one. That's a look adorable on little Toby. Toby. Right there, he just shot itself in the foot. Yeah. <laughs> that looks like a little big for a newborn mom. Oh, Lynn, we won't have time to shop like this when the time comes. How's this? Mm-hmm. And this? And what about this? Stop! I'm gonna startle the baby. I just jump scared the baby in the womb. Lamel. Ready? Here we go. I mean, we knew. <laughs> A little anticlimactic when we got spoiled already. I'm not gonna let you. Oh. <laughs> oh. I'm not gonna let y'all miss the chance for a reveal party. Well, let's talk about the one that got set a lot of houses on fire. Lamel. Well, at least you're not using a smoke machine. I felt a kick. That was just my stomach growling. Oh. Yeah, maybe dinner first. Wait, is that your stomach too? No. That wasn't? Nope. That wasn't your stomach? Yep, still beating in there. Still beating strong in there, little guy. It seems like. Hmm. What happened? What is it? Something wrong with the baby. No, the baby seems fine. It's just... You know, just out of precaution, let me book you a couple extra tests in the coming weeks. Hmm. A house. Oh. Your childhood home, huh? Yep. I wanted to take you here for a long time now. If only we lived closer to it. Better late than never. So, is this where you keep your nostalgic treasure? Oh, well, there's always something.
This dude's just reliving his life. Wow, you sure read a lot as a you sure read a lot as a kid. Yeah, I'd love to. It may feel like I lived many lived many different lifetimes. Mm. It's weird how I can imagine you saying that as a kid with a straight face. Huh? The little prince? Yeah, my dad gave this to me many years ago. It's strange how, as the years went by, the story meant something a little, something different to me. Hey, let's bring it back. Maybe we can read it to Toby one day. Mm -hmm. Toby. Water break. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm just. Well, it stops there, so we're in her memories, I guess. But I think we've known that. Blue, red. Oh. Are... are you sure? I'm afraid so. We've ran multiple scans. The development is acute, and it seems to be worsening rapidly. Why now, of all times? And the baby? The baby appears to be fine, but... But? Well... Well... Be Oh, I was about to just make a little joke. Oh, what was it? What's the joke? <laughs> Never mind. Okay. Let's get going. Well, because we caught this so early, there, uh, there is time to treat you, Linda. That's good! It's not certain, but the prognosis is decent if we... If we start treatment immediately. Wait, to start immediately? Is that... Okay. For the baby? Unfortunately, no. We need to prematurely induce birth before starting treatment. Induce birth? But it's too early. I know. We have facilities to try and keep the baby alive in that case, but... A birth this early is often not without lasting complications. And... Um, if we withhold my treatment until he's ready? And we'd miss the optimal window to help you. There should be time for the baby to continue development uninterrupted, but for you... Even in the best case, delayed treatment would still result in life-altering impairment. And in the worst case... Well... Hey doctor, we need you in room 5. I'll give you two a moment to think about it. I know it's difficult, but given its nature, you need to make a decision promptly. I'm sorry you have to choose. I know you'll understand. What were you even thinking? How did we... How did I ever think this was a good idea? It's my fault. You wouldn't have it if it weren't for me. That's not why I... It was like a hazy dream, you know? Traveling the world with you preparing for the baby. This past year, it was all so normal. I just didn't want to wake up. 
You should get the treatment. What? I'm saying it so you don't have to. Quincy. I'll do my best to take care of him regardless. But you? It's the only way that you'll even be able to. That's not fair to him. Neither would it be for him to grow up without a mom. That's... That's something we should have thought of way before. We made a mistake, okay? I made a mistake. We can't change the past, but we can still decide from this point on. Quince. We can't lose you. Hello? Okay. <laughs> okay, alright. Treatment's going. I've been in that situation once. For appendicitis. Oh. Yeah, dude, that, that 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, I got to 4 and I was already dead. Yep, because they make you talk, that's why. Yeah. And start making your talk, and realistically, while you're talking, you're inhaling a bunch of the the, the gas. You're just like, fuck. They just want to keep you talking. Yeah, that's all they do. <laughs> Until Literally. you have enough of it. Dude, I got enough of it pretty fast. You're <laughs> for sure. You're awake, Quince. How are you feeling? I I feel okay. The procedure went smoothly, Linry. We'll continue with the follow-ups, but so far, you're in the clear. And the baby? He's stable right now, but we need to monitor him here for another couple of months. His organs aren't fully developed and we're keeping him on ventilator. But even then, our help can only go so far. I'm not sure how he'll do as he grows up, but it won't be easy. Do your best to take care of him, okay? Wait, that machine fakes memories. We're too happy right now, this isn't real. A stroller! New stroller. Oxygen tank? Yep. For Toby. Toby.
ਮਤ ਹੈ ਯੂ ਇਜ਼ ਸਕੀ ਨਾ ਕਰਨ ਮੇਕੇ PTSD with cars in this game. Hmm. Let's follow next. Okay then. <laughs> ne- next Let's time. Stop moving. <laughs> Sighted motherfucker. Yeah, next time. Uh, ooh, pre- preview. Whoa. <laughs> Okay, bye. I thought you already ended it after you said that. <laughs>